Hello everyone, I am Dr. Sulbi Kapoor, Consultant Geneticist, Hegde Fertility. Today we will discuss what is reproductive genetics, how it is important and where, why it plays an important role in our infertility, in our pregnancy and pregnancy outcomes. Reproductive genetics is a basically a branch of reproductive health care that focus on the study of genetic factors that play an important role in our reproductive health. This study helps us to understand how our own genes, chromosomes or genetic variations impacts our fertility, our pregnancy and pregnancy outcomes. It also let us know how it can impact the health of our offspring. Reproductive genetics not only encompasses prenatal genetics and diagnostics, it also covers pregenetic counseling, pregenetic screening, PGT and ART. There are basically two major types of genetic abnormalities that can affect our fertility as well as our pregnancy. Chromosomal abnormality and gene abnormality. Chromosomal abnormality. The one of the most common reproductive chromosomal abnormality is translocation. Translocation is when a piece of chromosome from one chromosome breaks off and joins another chromosome. Any parent in either of the parent or an individual who is a carrier for translocation can lead to an abnormal number of chromosomes in an embryo and the embryos with the abnormal number of chromosomes will end up into either implantation failure or miscarriages. So this can lead to Down syndrome, this can lead to any sort of chromosomal abnormality in the kids. In men, in men the chromosomal abnormality can lead to an low sperm count or abnormal semen parameters or absence of sperm in the semen. Genetic variations in men like Y chromosomal deletion, cystic fibrosis, uh, or CFTR gene mutation, they can lead to either to the absence of sperms in the semen or low sperm count. So any men with low sperm count or absence of sperm in the semen should be, should, uh, be advised to get the genetic testing done. Any women with the recurrent implantation failure, prolonged infertility or recurrent pregnancy loss should be advised to get the genetic testing done. So reproductive genetics basically help us to understand the reasons why there is a reason, why there is prolonged infertility, why there is a risk of miscarriages or implantation failures at the genetic level. Reproductive genetics or reproductive genetic counseling help patients to understand the significance of genetic testing, help them to make informed decision to plan their pregnancy and outcome. Thank you.